Hi y'all, welcome back to the Cotton Trail. I thought this video might be just a little bit different. Um, so, as everyone here knows, or most everyone here knows, I am expecting this will be the third child that I birthed. <laughs> um, and he is a boy, and he is quite the surprise. Um, whenever I found out that I was pregnant, we had been going through kind of a really rough time with my dad passing and having just well we, first we had just first gotten over COVID and then my dad passed away which I am a massive massive daddy's girl and I really really miss him um so we were kind of going through a hard time there and uh, I haven't done much preparing the baby has measured kind of small at all of my ultrasounds which makes sense because stress can make your baby small and that could be totally what the issue is it could just be small who knows um today we went and we had an ultrasound done on his heart his heart looks wonderful so he looks good everything looks good and now to the fun things you know i went down to the shop and i had gotten out some baby things i found like a tote full of blankets and a tote full of some of my favorite baby items and I just thought we would dig through some very old, <laughs> very old buried treasures. Most of this stuff has been through two kids. So a lot of it is over 12 years old or around 12 years old. Um, I found my baby sling, which I'm very grateful for. I, I'm, I'm wanting to get one of those like tie on wraps because those look fabulous and way more comfortable than this thing, but definitely going to be giving that a good wash and using it. And guys, I am a sucker for overalls. Look at these. Aren't they so cute? Now these ones are a little bit big. These ones are 12 months, but I do have others. Keep going black. I'm always worried it's gonna turn off. Um, some six to nine month stuff. This was one of my favorites. I love these little rompers like this. That may be the wrong season. And when I say that I am a sucker for overalls, six to 12 months, perfect, because this baby will actually be born in the middle of summer. And kind of getting to this size, or should be right as winter gets here, and these are perfect for winter. We have some camouflage, because even before I was a farmer, I was definitely a country girl at least a little bit of one. Some of these things are not old favorites and I don't know how they ended up in the tote, but we will use them. Um, I have some really kind of special things here. Not that, I don't know if we'll use that or not. Some little button down shirt, that'll be cute. Oh, I have this little outfit if I can find the rest of it. My grandpa was actually a cop and a veteran. Um, and he was diagnosed with lung cancer while I was pregnant with my first baby. So like he said that he just really wanted to make it long enough to see him be born. And he did. And he went into remission and then of course his cancer came back, but we bought this little outfit specifically. It's a sheriff. Isn't it cute? Specifically for my grandpa and I still have the whole thing. And that will be such a cute way to just honor him and let him be kind of an influence on our new little boy. Um, I have another really important one. Now it's stained up. I know it is. If I can find the bottoms. Oh, there they are. So it's stained up and this thing has been through two kids and I think it came from like a family dollar. But... I'm excited to have it and I'm definitely going to wash it and use it and it is not necessarily my most cute thing but it is a very special thing because my mom passed away and she bought this little outfit as my oldest son's first outfit that anybody bought him. As soon as she found out that I was pregnant she went out and got this. It says I have a smile and I'm not afraid to use it so stand up or not this baby will probably wear it. And again like I said sucker for overalls. I think these are newborn. Zero to three months. Look how cute they are. Guys. Now, this is kind of funny. Let me find the other one. I know I have them. Okay. 
so we live in Arkansas. I am from Arkansas. Naturally, we have something with a hog on it. But my husband is from Missouri. And so we also have something with a tiger on it. And then I love little rompers, especially for summertime. Some of these may not necessarily be the, um, the right season, but we've got them. Some more camouflage. My favorite thing was to throw camouflage and overalls on my boys. I don't know why. And like, I have all the proof of that because whenever I was picking out my favorite things, we can see a theme. Look at this. Um, I loved nightgowns too, and I absolutely adored this, I call it a potato sack gown, so like it got no beats. Isn't it cute? This is like seriously finding just buried treasure. Now some of these things are kind of stained up and I probably won't actually use them, but some of these things are just a little cute. Sweats on little babies, aren't they adorable? So. I guess I'm gonna go through these things. Oh, look, my sister got this for my little boy whenever she was in college, that came from her college. I'm so excited to find some of these things, like seriously. More overalls, cause I had an overall problem. The first outfit that I bought this baby had overalls and I haven't really bought a whole lot. Um, little duckies. Oh goodness. Guys, this is so exciting. <laughs> uh, I haven't really had time to sit back and just be like, let's relish this and enjoy this, but man, those dogs are barking. And just, let's, but now, look at here, little McQueen's going through baby things. Really does just kind of bring out a little bit of <laughs> another pair of overalls have the cutest picture of my little boy in this. This little robe. I already bought one. I'd forgotten that I kept this one. I bought another one and it's got like farm stuff on it. So this baby will have two. Um, I have some of their like old Halloween costumes and things in here too that I'm not going to take the time to dig through. Some pants. Ah, the shorts from my hog shirt. And a sully tail from Halloween costume. <laughs> Uh, so I guess I'll finish going through these and get them washed and I will see you guys next time. Thank you for digging for treasure with me today.